So the machine we have behind us is a 1908 Gold Beer steam logging machine. And its purpose was to pull logs through the forest so that they would eventually be transported to the sawmill. This steam engine operates essentially by a wood fire boiling a steep kettle full of water, creating steam. It carries a variety of whistles on it, but back in the day really it only had one whistle for purposes of communication within the forest. If there was a need for communication over the side of a hill, they would have what's called a whistle pump, a small boy that had a wire that was attached to the whistle and he would watch the logging operation below and then pull the whistle at the right time so that the steam engineer could engage the machinery and pull the log up from an area where the engineer couldn't exactly see it. What we will be doing is a demonstration of how this machine actually moved logs through the forest. Essentially the loggers would drop the trees and this machine would roll the logs into two pole chutes, which is basically a road through the woods. They would drag these logs through the woods, eventually dumping them into Shaver Lake. It would be gathered up by the steamboat, the Michigan, transported over to the sawmill. The sawmill would then cut them into boards. The boards would then be dried, and after a period of time, when they had sufficient buoyancy, they would kick them into the flume. And then the flume was 42 miles long and would reach Clovis six and a half hours later. At the turn of the century, this was the latest and greatest technology. And so for 108 years old, it's a pretty fascinating machine.